What up, what up, Wimbush here. And today for my first tutorial on this channel, I'm gonna show you guys how we could push our level from UEFN onto a console. For this example, I'm gonna be using my Nintendo Switch, but this will also work on Xbox and PlayStation. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. So to get started, I have UEFN open. I have a level that I'm currently working on with Method Man right now inside of Fortnite Creative. And so if I scroll around here, you can see I'm building out a comic book shop. But let's say I want to take this level right here and I want to test it out on a game console. So again, I'm going to be using my Nintendo Switch and it's really easy to do. So up here at the top where you see launch session, if you click on these three dots right here, you can connect the platform. And if you click on this and then you launch your session, it's actually going to launch it onto your game console. Now, the only thing is the Epic Games account that you have that you're working on your PC. You also want to make sure that's the same exact account that's on your console as well. And you'll be able to actually make changes inside the level while also making changes on your game console as well. So we can see the level is built out right now. I have my character in there, which is actually my Fortnite avatar. So I'm just running around while the level is getting built out. It might take a few moments here on a switch. I tested this out on my Xbox earlier, as you can see inside of this video, and it worked perfectly fine. But I think because the Nintendo Switch is a less powered machine, it might take a few more moments for it to actually load into the session here. But that did take a few moments, but it looks like everything is loaded up on the Nintendo Switch. So let's give it a trial run and see how everything loads in. So I'm just playing with my controller right now, my pro controller. So this is the comic book level I currently have I'm building out for Method Man right now. As you can see, we have like this DJ booth over here. We have some posters on here for some stuff that we've worked on. There's a comic book with Method Man and Snoop. We have a fake comic book here. We have a comic book cover from animation I did with Method Man. And we have a lot of stuff in here. We're just building it out right now. But it's cool to actually see your level playing out here. So I could run here inside the back room. Everything looks like it's playing pretty smooth here. Like we have some art here that we have posted up working on a comic book. We're going to have some panels in there from the comic book we're working on. But this is really neat being able to see your late, your whole level like built out in fruition here and being able to play it here on the fly. So any changes that I make inside of Fortnite Creative, I can always push it to my game consoles, my Xbox, my Switch and just see how it plays out and see how it feels and then make the adjustments accordingly. So hopefully this first tip helped you guys out. Get started inside of Unreal Engine for Fortnite. I know for me, I've been learning a lot of stuff just going in and playing around, but now being able to push my level to any game console and just kind of test it out, it gives me a whole new different feel, how everything's feeling for the end user as they play it on their game console. So if you find this helpful, make sure you leave me a comment down below. Again, this is a brand new channel, so make sure you subscribe. It's definitely going to help me out and help me to continue to push these tips and tricks for you guys. And until next time, stay fresh, keep creating, and keep building. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you soon. Take care.